Hi Libra, welcome to To Our Readings by Roxby. I am going to do a bi-weekly for you guys. It's going to cover the next two weeks. It's going to go from October 1st to the 15th, 2018. It will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. It's a general reading, Libra. If the, res if the reading does not resonate for you, please watch your other signs. I'm using Wheel of the Year for you guys. I also want to wish you guys a very happy, beautiful birthday. Those of you that are celebrating over the next two weeks, I wish you guys nothing but the best. You know, just thank you all so much. You know, I truly appreciate you guys so, so much. Those of you that would like to get a private reading, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Instant Go for if you want a quick question answered. Links to everything that you guys need are right below the video in the description box. The Ace of Wands actually did flip out for you guys. Clarity, exciting, passionate, creative, venture, new beginning. There's also an angel there too. You know, definitely I feel being divinely and spiritually guided on the path that you're meant to be on. Also, Libra, if you're not subscribed to my channel, please be sure to click the subscribe and also hit the bell so that you get notified of when I post your readings and go live here on YouTube. So I'm going to do it totally different this week because I'm doing a, I'm doing two weeks for you guys. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. We have Cancer here. The Eight of Cups. Six of Pentacles. Tower. Sign of Scorpio. Could be a time frame for some of you. Nine of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. Ten of Cups. This will be your overall energy for the next two weeks. The Two of Pentacles. The bottom of the deck the high priestess is here so a lot of you are going to be listening to your intuition others of you definitely a secret could be coming out whether you're keeping a secret someone else's some of you with the two of pentacles you're juggling going back and forth up and down could be you you know making a decision you know there is a lot of pentacles in this spread libra it could be a, you know you're trying to make a decision about something as well maybe in regards to a home a job Something to do with maybe assets and inheritance, a promotion, something related to career. You know, the chariot and the king of wands sitting right next to each other. So some of you could be dealing with a cancer, but I do feel for many of you that you're moving forward. You know, you're taking control. You're steering this chariot where you want it to go. You know, and, and even with the King of Wands sitting next to this, you know, this is someone that likes to take action, very impulsive. You know, when this person wants something, he goes after it. 
you know, for some of you, I really do feel like you're taking control, moving forward. Something is moving forward over the next two weeks. You know, with the energy of the chariot, if things have been stagnant, you know, this energy literally, and it's, you know, your first card out comes in and it really pushes things forward. I definitely see things happening for you this week. I see you really taking control, maybe just getting something started. Maybe you're making the decision to do this. And, the, you know, the Chariot is the ultimate victory and success card. Some of you might be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sag, male. You know, what's interesting, though, is the chair is the tower card is under the chariot. You could have gone through a tower situation. Maybe you experienced some difficulties. There could have been an ending of some sort. Definitely, you know, with the eight of cups. You know, definitely somebody left, moved on, moved forward. Or this will be happening in the time of Scorpio. You know, very suddenly. But, you know, with the tower, you know, we did just see the Ace of Wands fall out. The tower comes in, you know, it, it brings everything to the ground. I'm a fan of the tower. I am. You know, it wipes the, state, the slate clean so that you could start over fresh. For some of you, it could be a new home. You could be waiting on a decision about this home, making a decision. But whatever this is for you, no matter how it's affecting you, I do feel like it's positive because for some of you, even if you've gone through some a difficult period, you're absolutely moving away from it. And, and you are moving toward more abundance and happiness, especially financially. Abundance, prosperity, living comfortably. This could be a promotion. You're moving up within the company that you work for. Even news, communication could be coming in very suddenly, unexpected. You know, I absolutely see you receiving something because of the Six of Pentacles. You know, it is a generous energy. You know, this person is handing, handing you something. You know, it could be with the Two of Pentacles, the High Priestess, I just feel like many of you really are in decision mode, trying to make a decision. Many of you receiving a decision suddenly that's allowing for you to move forward. You know, the Eight of Cups is moving forward, moving on, looking into the, you know, moving, looking into the future, walking away from something that is no longer serving you emotionally any longer. You know, moving forward in your life and listening to your intuition when it comes to this. And I feel like too, it's something you're very focused on. Something that you've been working on for a long time, putting a lot of time, energy, and effort into whatever it is that you're focused on. But it's what you want. You want to move forward or you want to move up within the, within the company that you work for, new home, working hard on that. You know, but you end with, you know, completing a difficult cycle. Again, referring back to the ace that flipped up for you guys. 
And this is really having it all. It's happiness, abundance, success. It's you feeling very happy emotionally. You know, and I do feel strongly that the changes that are taking place for you are absolutely better for you than you could have even imagined. Just really listen to your intuition. Look at that. There's your new beginning. And in, information, communication is definitely coming in. Beautiful. Not only that, you get the Wheel of Fortune with this card too in this deck. Suddenly, quickly, definitely. Totally out of the blue. Unexpected. Let me pull you guys. This is wrong. Healing with the angels. I haven't used these cards in a while. And I really felt the need to pull them out. Libra. What else does Libra need to know? Okay. This card flipped over. It beautiful. Okay. Indriel. Indriel. Hope I'm saying that right. You are a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon the earth and all of its in inhibitants. Beautiful. You are a light worker. Beautiful, guys. Hope it helps you guys out for the next two weeks. Absolutely love you guys. Appreciate you guys so much. I will see you guys back here very, very soon. Till then, take care, Libra. Bye-bye.